Navigating Troubled Waters, Understanding, Riding a Sinking Ship. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we dive deep into the fascinating world of the English language. Today, we're exploring a very interesting phrase, riding a sinking ship. This metaphor is rich in imagery and meaning, and by the end of this video, you'll not only understand what it means but also how to use it in your daily conversations. So, let's set sail into today's topic. The phrase, riding a sinking ship, is a metaphor used to describe a situation where someone is sticking with a project, organization, or endeavor that is failing or about to fail. It paints a vivid picture of a dire situation, much like being on a ship that's going down into the ocean. This phrase can be used in various contexts, from business and relationships to personal projects and careers. While the exact origins of the phrase are difficult to pinpoint, it's rooted in the literal experience of ships sinking in the ocean. Historically, the idea of a sinking ship has always been associated with inevitable doom, disaster, or failure. Over time, this concept was borrowed into the English language as a metaphor to describe failing endeavors in a way that's easy for people to visualize and understand. To help you understand how to use riding a sinking ship in your conversations or writing, here are a few examples. In business, despite the innovative ideas from new employees, many felt they were just riding a sinking ship as the company continued to lose money. In relationships, staying in a relationship that's clearly not working anymore is like riding a sinking ship. It's better to leave before it's too late. Personal endeavors, Continuing to invest time and money into my failing business felt like riding a sinking ship. So I decided it was time to pursue something new. It's also important to know when not to use this phrase. It should not be used to describe situations that are temporarily challenging but salvageable. The phrase implies a level of inevitability and doom that may not be appropriate for all situations. In a very light or trivial context, given its origins and the imagery it conjures, using it for minor issues might be overly dramatic. Understanding phrases like, riding a sinking ship, not only enriches your vocabulary but also helps you communicate more effectively and creatively. We hope this exploration has illuminated this fascinating phrase for you. Remember, the beauty of the English language lies in its depth and diversity. Keep sailing through it, and don't hesitate to drop us a comment if there's another phrase or idiom you're curious about. Until next time, keep learning and exploring.